Do you ever feel like everyone around you is more financially secure? Like you're constantly playing catch up while others seem to be thriving? Like you're the only one struggling to make ends meet? Financial stress can feel isolating and overwhelming. You see people on vacation buying new cars and dining at fancy restaurants. Their lives appear so carefree and luxurious. And you wonder, how do they afford all of this? What are they doing differently? The truth is, you're not alone. Many people feel the same way, even if they don't show it. This feeling is incredibly common. It's a shared experience that many of us go through. But it's often based on a distorted view of reality. Social media and appearances can be misleading. People rarely advertise their financial struggles. They hide their worries and only show the highlights. We see their successes, their vacations, their new gadgets. But that's just one side of the story. What we don't see are the credit card bills, the student loans, the sacrifices made behind the scenes, the financial burdens they carry. It's important to remember that appearances can be deceiving. What looks like wealth might be debt in disguise. Not everyone who looks wealthy actually is. Many are just trying to keep up appearances. And even those who are financially comfortable have their own challenges and insecurities. Everyone has their own battles, even if they aren't visible. Social media has amplified this feeling of financial inadequacy, making it more pervasive than ever before. It's a carefully curated highlight reel of people's lives, showcasing only the moments they want you to see. We see their best moments, their biggest successes, their most enviable possessions, all presented in a way that makes them seem perfect. But it's not real life. It's a snapshot, a fleeting moment that doesn't capture the full picture. It's a filtered, edited, and often exaggerated version of reality, designed to impress and garner likes and followers. People present the image they want the world to see, not necessarily the reality of their daily lives. They spend time and effort crafting these perfect images. Scrolling through social media can make us feel like we're not good enough, rich enough, or successful enough. It can create a sense of inadequacy and envy. It's easy to fall into the trap of comparing ourselves and our lives to the carefully constructed images we see online, forgetting that these images are often far from the truth. This feeling of financial inadequacy is also fueled by societal pressures. We live in a consumerist culture that constantly tells us we need more, more, more. More clothes, more gadgets, more experiences, we're bombarded with advertising that makes us feel like we're not enough without the latest and greatest products. This pressure to keep up with the Joneses can lead to overspending, debt, and a constant feeling of being behind. It's important to remember that your worth is not defined by your possessions. True happiness and fulfillment come from within, not from material things. So how do you combat this feeling of financial inadequacy? It starts with taking control of your own finances. This means understanding where your money is going, creating a budget, and making conscious spending choices. Financial literacy is crucial. The more you understand about money, the better equipped you'll be to manage it effectively. There are countless resources available to help you learn about budgeting, investing, and saving. Remember, personal finance is just that. Personal. What works for one person may not work for another. The key is to find a system that fits your lifestyle and goals. Section 5. Budgeting for Success Creating a budget doesn't have to be complicated. Start by tracking your income and expenses for a month. This will give you a clear picture of where your money is going. Once you understand your spending patterns, you can identify areas where you can cut back. Look for small, manageable changes you can make to your spending habits. Can you eat out one less time per week? Can you find a more affordable gym membership? Small changes can add up to big savings over time. Section 6. Investing in your future. Saving is important, but it's also crucial to make your money work for you. Investing is one of the best ways to build long-term wealth. You don't need to be a financial expert to invest. Start by learning the basics and consider investing in low-cost index funds. 
These funds are a great way to diversify your portfolio and reduce risk. Remember, investing is a marathon, not a sprint. Be patient, stay consistent, and don't panic sell when the market fluctuates. Section 7. Shifting Your Perspective One of the most powerful things you can do is shift your perspective. Instead of focusing on what you don't have, focus on what you do have. Be grateful for the roof over your head, the food on your table, and the people in your life. Cultivating an attitude of gratitude can help you feel more content and less envious of others. Remember, comparison is the thief of joy. When you find yourself comparing your financial situation to others, gently redirect your attention to your own goals and progress. The Section 8. Defining Your Own Rich Life Ultimately, rich is a subjective term. It varies from person to person, and what one individual considers rich might be completely different from another's perspective. What does it mean to you to live a rich life? Take a moment to reflect on your personal values and aspirations. It might mean financial freedom, the ability to live without worrying about money, and having the resources to enjoy life. But it could also mean having strong relationships, pursuing your passions, and spending time doing what you love, or making a difference in the world, contributing to causes you care about, and leaving a positive impact. Define your own version of success. What are the goals that truly resonate with you? Create a financial plan that aligns with your values and goals. This plan should be a reflection of what you deem important. Focus on what truly matters to you. Whether it's family, health, or personal growth, prioritize these aspects. Let go of the need to keep up with anyone else's definition of rich. Your journey is your own, and comparisons can be misleading. Remember, your financial journey is unique to you. Celebrate your successes, no matter how small, and learn from your mistakes. Keep moving forward toward your own version of a rich and fulfilling life. Embrace the journey and cherish each step along the way.